so welcome back guys to the new video and in this video we're gonna talk about twitter and elon musk so as you already know back in april 2022 elon musk announced he gonna buy twitter and his idea behind this deal was he wants to make significant improvements on twitter such as he want to make this platform free speech as well as he want to remove some spam bots but just after two months he decided to back off from this deal because he accused twitter for violating the purchase agreement by misrepresenting the number of spam and fake bot accounts and in return twitter decided to sue musk and accused him that he had used the bots as a pretext to exit the deal and after all of this drama musk decided to move forward and buy twitter for 44 billion dollars and he finally completed this deal on 27th of october when he posted a tweet regarding it where he said entering twitter hq let that sink in and he also posted a video clip in it so here's the clip And this Twitter thread, he also said, meeting a lot of cool people at Twitter today. A beautiful thing about Twitter is how it empowers citizen journalism. People are able to disseminate news without an establishment bias. And under this tweet, many people as well as content creators reacted, such as popular Twitch streamer Trainwreck said, yeah, expect for the fact that vocal Twitter minority are generally stupid and let their own bias dictate narrative and let's not even start with the political internet creators who manipulate that by pumping lots of disinformation into the fields for their own power, money and control. And even one of the journalists, Alison Rodriguez, she said, and do you consider local news citizen journalism? Have you have been inside newsroom and seen the everyday workings to make statements on news bias? Genuinely curious. By replying this, Elon Musk said, definitely closer to citizen journalism. Local news orgs are underappreciated and should get way more and should get way more prominent on Twitter and even Elon Musk changed his Twitter bio where he said chief tweet and some of his images also shared from Twitter headquarters and a week ago a report by Bloomberg tells that Musk decided to lay off 75% employment from Twitter but according to the latest update Musk only decided to lay off only 25% of the staff by the end of the next year and I believe many of the reports by media houses Elon Musk wants to make Twitter a free speech platform but according to a recent tweet by Elon Musk he revealed what will he he changed on twitter so basically he posted three pages regarding it so basically he said i wanted to reach out personally to share my motivation in acquiring twitter there has been much speculation about why i bought twitter and what i think about advertising most of it has been wrong the reason i acquired twitter is because it is important to the future of civilization the future of civilization to have a common digital town square where a wide range of beliefs can be debated in a healthy manner without resorting to violence there is currently great danger that social media will splinter into far right wing and far left wing echo chambers that generate more hate and divide our society in the randomized pursuit of clicks much of traditional media has fueled and catered to those polarized extremists as they believe that is what brings in the money but in doing so the opportunity for dialogue is lost this is why i bought twitter i didn't do it because it would be easy i didn't do it to make more money i did it to try to help humanity whom i love and i do so with humility recognizing that failure in pursuing this goal despite our best efforts is a very real possibility that said twitter obviously cannot become a free for all healthscape where anything can be said with no consequence in addition to adhering to the laws of the land, our platform must be warm and welcoming to all where you can choose your desired experience according to your preferences just as you can choose for example to see movies or play video games ranging from all ages to mature. I'm also very much believe that advertising when done right can delight, entertain and inform you. It can show you a service or product or medical treatment that you never knew existed but is right for you. For this to be true it is essential to show Twitter users advertising that is as relevant as possible to their needs. Low relevancy ads are spam but highly relevant ads are actually content. Fundamentally, Twitter aspires to be the most respected advertising platform in the world that strengthens your brands and grows your enterprise. To everyone who has partnered with us, I thank you. Let us build something extraordinary together. Even a rapper Zubi also commented on this where he said, yes, also Twitter should find a way to compensate monetization power with its top creators like every other social media app. A 
स्मॉल पर्सन क्रिएट ऑल दी हाई एंगेजमेंट कॉन्टेंट एंड कीप द साइट एक्टिव एंड इलोन मस्ट रिप्लाइड ऑन दिस एब्सोल्यूटली वेल मेनी पीपल कंपेयरिंग नाउ इलोन मस्ट टू कार्निया बेस्ट प्री स्पीच कॉस्ट कार्निया बिलियन डॉलर एलोन आर यू टेकिंग नोट एज वेल एज अनदर यूजर सेट एलन मस्क एंड कार्निया बेस्ट है लॉट इन कॉमन दे बोथ आर बाइंग सोशल प्लेटफॉर्म टू ऑन द लीव एंड दे आर बोथ अबाउट टू लूज अ बंच ऑफ मनी इन दी प्रोसेस दे आर फंड अराउंड एंड एलोन विल ज्वाइन कार्निया इन फाइंडिंग आउट वेल वट यू गैस थिंक अबाउट इट प्लीज कमेंट डाउन बिलो एंड लाइक दिस वीडियो एंड सब्सक्राइब दिस चैनल आई विल सी इन नेक्स्ट वीडियो अंडल दैन बाय बाय